From my window Sun's coming up like the day before You're like a stone on my pillow I don't make a sound when I shut the door your favorite music gone all the way baritone oh, yeah. shut the lights go in front of All right, I'm kind of upset because, well, first of all, good morning, you guys. Hope you guys um, are having a good day whenever you're watching this, but my day started off good until now. So I ordered some items earlier this week for, um, I ordered some more shipping labels because I ran out and then I ordered some more um, emulsifying wax to make some more hair cream, which is very important. <laughs> Those two very important things for my business. So it says it was delivered yesterday. So it was really late last night by the time I saw that it was delivered because I already I had already checked the mail that day and I already had packages in there. So, you know, I just thought, you know, the packages were delivered. And so that was all I had for that day. So I go on Amazon. It says your shipment was delivered. Oh, my, OK, so I'll just go in the morning to the mailbox after I take the kids to the bus stop, check the mail and then bring it in so I can get these orders out for you guys because I needed the shipping labels. Well. It says it was delivered, but I look in my mailbox, look on my front porch, and it's not there, okay? So, I don't know what's going on with the postman here on post, but he's screwing up people's um, packages because 
when I went to the mailbox this morning, there was a lady there struggling with her key. And I'm guessing that they probably gave her the wrong key, just like they did me one time. And my um, sponsorship package went missing. A whole sponsorship just down the drain because I, I, they messed up my package, which was really messed up. So I contacted Amazon really easy i went just went on um the live chat like the chat thing and chatted with them for literally two minutes and they already put in an order for a replacement so hopefully the replacement actually gets shipped to me on time it is it's like the post office i understand people make mistakes i get it mistakes happen no one's perfect but then when you go and think about the other person who received my package who probably is at the same mailbox as me <laughs> And you know I live here. Like, why wouldn't you just return it? Maybe my sponsorship package, you wanted to keep that. Because that was a good one. I have some more packaging packages arriving today. Another one arriving tomorrow. So, hopefully, they all get here okay. And I receive everything that I need. I'm going to go ahead and finish packaging some orders. I think I have like three orders I have to package today. Then I'm going to get them out and get them shipped off. I really wanted to spend today out to get the kids some jackets because it's starting to get cool here and it's been raining. So they need jackets with hoods and all their jackets are kind of like small and don't fit. So I really wanted to go take a trip to TJ Maxx, find them a couple jackets and then come back home and kind of just chill for the day. This kind of put me in like a funky mood. So hopefully, and it's like not cute outside. It's raining, gloomy, sad looking. So that on top of my packages being missing is like, a recipe for disaster for me so i'm gonna go ahead and finish packaging these orders and then i'm gonna head out and drop them off i'm packing up you guys' orders right now and this is like the best packaging i could have ever came up with for these this is like so perfect i'm literally obsessed with it but i have someone who ordered the split in serum and the hydrating curl custard so i have your order right here and I'm gonna go ahead and print off the labels in the shipping, um, the shipping label and the packing slip. And then I have to head to the PX to pick up some boxes and then I'll get them shipped out. I just dropped off the packages. I had to drop one package off that was going to Australia from Mocha Cosmetics. So I just had to drop that off at UPS. I'm up to date on all my work. I feel so good and motivated because I got all my work out today, all my packages. And then on top of that, I got today's video edited and uploaded last night. So it's already going live, you know, today, this morning. So feeling really good I don't have to worry about any work today well the only thing that I do have to do today is make some more hair cream because I'm sold out again so thank you guys so much for just buying that stuff up because I enjoy making it just as much as I enjoy you guys buying it so I'm about to head to TJ Maxx to look around I want to see if they have some jackets for the kids and then um, whip up some more hair cream and then that'll be the end of my day today um, so yeah, I got the bulk of my work done today, which was really good. So now it's my time to relax, do some shopping, and just enjoy the day. That's so cute. The spice rack is so cute. I love that. It's $20. This bridge organizer is only $10. So I found one I like. It's 
twenty dollars. Like a size eight. I really wish I could get like. I mean, I mean, I guess this could fit him. Yeah, I'm gonna hold this in my cart, but I really would rather get a ten. Oh, I feel like the eight's big enough. I couldn't decide on a jacket, so I'll get this shirt. It's seven ninety nine. It's a Levi's shirt. All right, you guys see the shirt that I have on? I got this from Walmart. Why do I find almost the exact same thing in TJ Maxx? And it comes with socks. For $9.99. I also picked up that same bra, just in a different color. $7.99. All right, I've made it back home. And so this is what I picked up from TJ Maxx. I got the bra, the same bra, just in a different color. And then I picked up Brock a shirt because I bought my daughter some shirts the other day and water bottles, which I forgot to look at water bottles in TJ Maxx. But I, I tried to find him something in the PX and in Sam's Club and I couldn't find anything. So TJ Maxx had this really cute shirt for him. So it's getting chilly here. So I might start buying some more long sleeves for both of them. And then I also bought these plantain chips now i've never had plantains before so i'm gonna go ahead and try these they had a chili no they had a lime flavor and then a chili lime i think this is just like original flavor i'm scared this is how it looks mm. i'm not a picky eater honestly they taste like regular potato chips. They're a little crunchier than Lay's, but that's exactly what they taste like. This tastes like just like a Lay's chip. It's gonna be a good YouTube and Amazon movie snack. And I also got a package. I'm gonna go ahead and open it. Just in time. I ran out of bubble mailers, so I bought some more. Oh, and this is the cocoa butter that I use. And that is it. I may go ahead and make this hair cream and then take me a nap because I'm still kind of sleepy. I long for that feeling.
package in. I almost tripped over it <laughs> getting the kids from the bus stop. I didn't even see it down there, but I think this is the smaller boxes that I ordered for um, both of my businesses, mainly for pretty hair care, because the boxes that I've been getting from the PX have been just like slightly too big for just the three products. So, yes, it is the boxes. Ah, I'm so excited! Okay, that was ugly. So let's see, I gotta put it together though. Okay, let's let's figure this out. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Slightly too small for eyeshadow. I can't figure out this either. All right, let's do this. Let's do this. What in the world? We got it, okay. This, this is how it goes. There, I figured it out. I get a lot of you guys who order all three products, so now they fit in there nicely. Oh my gosh, that looks so, so good. This, is, this was the perfect size for this. That way the products aren't moving around that much and it just works out really good this way. So um, this was a good investment. I'm glad I got these boxes. So while I'm cooking, kids are over there. They don't have any homework, but she has to practice her letters. P, watch to yourself. Oh. P, like to yourself, really? So she's doing that. Brock's over there reading a book I bought like a, a while ago. It's a... Uh, I think I got it at Sam's Club. It's a Michael Jordan uh, book. And he's reading chapter books now, so. It's like a short chapter book. Huh? That's awesome. It's 25 chapter books. Ooh. Three days. Three days? So he's reading that. He has to read a chapter every day. I got news. Girl, go read your letters. These are so good. But right now I'm making baked spaghetti. Here's dinner, baked spaghetti. Really easy dinner tonight. Yummy. Here goes the kids' plates right here. Oh, I'm so ready for dinner. This looks so good. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'm gonna end it right here. Here comes baby Drew. She never misses the outro, but hope you guys enjoyed the video. And if you did, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you all in my next one. Bye. Bye.